Hey chickies! Okay, today we are doing water marbling again. Oh, I don't know why I keep doing this, but anywho, it's fun. Let's get into it. I hope you like. Now, first up, you want to use a base colour. Because I'm using neons, I'm using China Glazer's White on White, which is really good for um, base for neons. Also, uh, tape up your fingers. I'm using washi tape, but you can use any kind of tape. And I'm also using the tiny side of a dotting tool to create the design. Now onto the water marbling. You need uh, room temperature water. Uh, it can be tap water. I have used tap water before. People say it has to be uh, the distilled water or bottled water, but I have actually used tap water. So if in a pinch you don't have any bottled water, you can use tap water, but it has to be the temperature. I think the temperature is what is what is the most important thing. And they, everybody says room temperature, but as I've said before, if your room is cold, your water is going to be cold. And the colder it is, the faster your polish will dry and the less likely it is to spread. So, as you can see, I've just dropped a heap of um, spots of polish into the water that I'm using. I am actually using bottled water, so scratch everything I just said. But yes, I am using bottled water because I went out and bought some. But I have used tap water and it hasn't been a problem. So. Uh, once you've got your design and funnily enough i did not do a lot of work on the design with this one and i okay so this is funny i put all of my fingers into the water and then pulled them out and i only liked one of them i mean look at that <laughs> and this is probably um only because i'm using neons neons tend to dry a lot faster and yeah just it was a whole mess so this many ended up being a little less water marbly because uh, i took off the other three fingers that, that the pinky and the ring finger and the index finger because they just looked awful i didn't like them and i thought well let's do something else taking the polish off the other three nails i decided to do something different on each of those nails uh, with my pinky i decided to do a ruffian which is basically painting not all the way to the end of your to the, the cuticle of your nail and even if it's not um, perfect if it's not got perfect lines you could do what I did and put dots on it which is what I do with everything if I don't like it I'll put dots on it yeah it's probably kind of weird but there you go I'm still using the same colors that I used for the water marble I just painted those nails and added some cute little studs from polish me to go oh and always um, if you're using neon polishes paint them over a white base because that'll make them really really bright and that's it. I really hope you liked this one. It was, um, I know I was really wordy in this one. I do apologize if anybody hates the sound of my voice. Thank you so much for watching. I'll see you next time. Bye, chickies. Oh, and thanks for subscribing and thanks for the thumbs up. Bye.